Over here is where I'm going to have my main work area. And I've used some more of these metal cabinets to kind of support a makeshift bench right now. I'm having a custom top made for this. And until it's available, I just got to deal with this. Um, as much as I hate dealing with it. Um, it's fine for now. But uh, anyway, I'm going to be putting up kind of a, a splash board backer here. I've got some ideas for that I'll be sharing with you in a little while. Oh, by the way, too, here is the uh, explosion-proof lighting. I've pulled the guts out of this and made it into a lamp. That's going to be lighted, uh, lit up in here somewhere. I, I don't know where it's going to be mounted. I thought about wall or ceiling mount, or even just letting it sit like that as a, as a freestanding lamp is kind of cool. Uh, let's see, I've got some storage down here, too. I got some of these um, kind of military-issue collapsible plastic crates which are fantastic uh, they fit in there perfectly and I've got one more in this cabinet over here I'd like to get a few more that I can stack in there but perfect to label put labels on them pull them in and out of there real easy I got my standard junk drawer it's got a lot of crap in it that I I look at every time I need an idea I open this drawer and fool around a little bit see what I can find in there but there isn't a whole lot of organization what I got going on here. So, goal number one for today, we're going to try to get this cabinet up if it kills me. Again, I'm doing this solo. We're going to try to get some paint on the wall. And then I got a special plan for the floor, too. It's pretty butt ugly right now, but I plan on doing something interesting with it that'll kind of fit with my theme, whatever that is. Yeah, what is my theme, anyway? Well, to be honest with you, uh, when I think about this room and how I want it to look in the end, it's kind of a, a sci-fi meets, meets rugged industrial kind of a look. Um, imagine maybe, maybe something from, from Half-Life 2. I take inspiration from, from that, uh, from Half-Life, games like Half-Life. Um, you know, some of the, uh, in, you know, military structures and, and vehicles and things and aliens are, are kind of cool. Uh, in fact, the finish that I put on this blast cabinet, I'm calling Galactic Grime. So it's, it's kind of, kind of uh, has a retro sort of feel to it, but I'm going after sort of a sci-fi retro, if that makes any sense. I don't know. Maybe as I get closer to the end and it comes together, I'll even understand what I'm doing. Anyway, I uh, salute you, Mod Nation. Later. You know, you work in a space that's, I don't know, even a few years old, and you never know what kind of crazy stuff you're going to find. If you look over my shoulder there, that's what I found when I pulled the cabinet down.